Hello viewers, welcome to Ultimate Gaming Guide. As usual, I'm Tanver. What's happening with everybody today? I hope everybody's doing great. So in this video, I'll be doing a walkthrough for uh, Desperados Wanted Dead or Alive Mission 9. So if you don't know what happened in the last mission is like uh, they found information from a US Marshal that uh, Sanchez is behind all these train robberies. So now they're going to one of the Sanchez's outposts to find out uh, some information about him. So let's get to the stage. As usual, listen to the briefing very carefully to know what's going on. Snake's alive, John. What have you got us into this time? All these vultures circling around make me mighty uneasy. It's one of Sanchez's secret outposts. His gang sometimes lies low here when they've been out on a raid. You mean, with a bit of luck, we might run into Sanchez himself? I don't think there's much chance of that. He doesn't ride along on a raid much. He likes to let the others do his dirty work. So what the hell are we doing here? Because I don't know where Sanchez has his headquarters. So what's your plan? Well, it's a little risky. The main thing is that the guys sitting by the campfire up north don't know a thing about it. We'll sneak up to the woods, steal their horses, and lead them into that secluded valley in the northwest. All but one. The leader's horse tied up outside the cabin. With a little luck, he'll ride off to get fresh horses. With us following right on his heels, that way we find out where Sanchez hides out. That's right. And we need to get rid of the prisoners once we've stolen the horses. You reckon the soldier will cooperate? He won't have much choice. I'll free him, knock him out, and drag him straight off. That'll give us a head start and keep the heat off for a while. Oh, sounds complicated. Let's go. Okay, so just that was the briefing. If you don't know, like, uh, if you missed the briefing, you can always, like, press escape and read about it. So what's your plan here is to, like, go through these woods and uh, come over here uh, close to the camp. But don't let anybody know in the camp or don't make any noise when you're in the camp or when you're near the camp. What are you going to do? Your goal is to like, steal these horses and lead them up here in this secluded valley. So and uh, then find and free this soldier and knock him out uh, and tie him up. So but uh, what they're going to think this Yankee soldier actually like uh, and a free, uh, it was able to free himself and uh, stole all the horses. Since they're all their horses were stolen, the rider, the, there's only one horse uh, that's tied to the front of the house. There were, that's where the leader is. So what they're going to do, uh, the leader has to go, actually has to go to Sanchez's headquarters to get fresh horses. And then the, all the heroes will follow him. And that's how we're going to find, they're going to find you know, Sanchez's headquarter. Okay, so we're, this is the beginning of the stage. Uh, we can use uh, pretty much uh, John Cooper to, or maybe I can just use like a Kate O'Hare instead. Okay, after I kill those two, I need to go a little bit further. Maybe I can just knock him out. There we go. That's pretty sweet. I need to take this body out, otherwise these people will get like feisty. Yeah, he will. I I think he will probably. Yeah, it looks like he's getting agitated. Yeah, don't give him that chance. Okay, so it looks uh looks like uh see these all all these stars in front of their head. I'm on top of their head. I could just like you know take care of them. Just stab them with the knife. And there's two more guys here. Uh, there's two guys together. Uh, that guy is looking the other way, so maybe I can use uh, Kate O'Hara. Oh, 
there is a dead body here, so I have to get rid of that. Otherwise, they were gonna suspect. Okay. Okay. So I should take Kerohara uh, into his like a uh, field of view, and they're gonna come see me. Come on. Okay. So and I also kicked that guy as well. Nice. So uh, in this mission, I'm gonna use Kato Hera more. You know, uh, when you use the Kato Hera's kick, she actually like um, when when she walks, she walks on her toes. So you you're not gonna be able to hear a sound. So which is pretty great. And this guy you can also take care of uh, using Kato Hera. Just gotta get closer. Okay, come here. Okay, so I'll get rid of these body quickly. Okay, so you see this guy here, any kind of sound and he will just run and run and let everybody know in the camp there is something going wrong in here. So you don't you don't want him to raise any you don't want him to like get alert this guy. So by the meanwhile, I'll I'll hide these bodies. And this guy, I will just stab him. Make sure he don't wake up ever. Somebody else want to turn? Yeah, and uh, you can't. This guy, you can't even like you know distract him uh, using uh, Kato Hera. So you gotta be careful here. And there's another guy, so I have to watch out for his field of view as well. And uh, make sure you. I use. Just get really close, and and you. Get rid of the body quickly over here. There's this guy here, so I can also get rid of him. Oh, there's there's two guys over here. One of them you can get rid of using Kato Hera, and uh, that's what I will do. Make sure you hide John here in the woods. Otherwise, they're gonna see John. Okay, so. Kato Hera over here. Maybe I should hide John over here instead. They're not seeing me over here, so I gotta get a little bit closer. They're not seeing me yet. He saw me. I still have to retrieve my knife though. I'll just use Kato Hair to kick him. And make sure I hide the bodies. And I'll stab him. So make sure he don't ever wake up. Okay, so I just need to get rid of these two guys. And there's a one. Oh, that's a problem. So maybe I need... I have just one. Uh, I mean, knockout gas. And... Oh, maybe... It's, okay. Just one knockout gas. And maybe I can use snake. I'm not sure what to use here. There's two guys here, and and this guy is uh okay. So get them all into the woods for now. Okay. So. Okay. So you see two of these guys here s sitting here, uh, the one with the like the 
uh, blue uniform or like a fat guy who's standing, if he like uh, hear anything, like anything at all, like then uh, he's what he's going to do. He's going to just run and let the people in the campfire know. So we can't let him do that. So what I'm going to do instead, I'm going to knock this guy out and I'm going to use knife on this guy. He's kind of agitated right now. Hey, you. We got here. He's very close to me, but I don't have my knife, so I can't knock him out. Okay, so these two guys, uh, maybe I should just use knockout gas on them. Should be easy here. What now? Yes, and this this mission is pretty much about like uh, uh, using uh, John Cooper and uh, Kate O'Hara because you can't use the other two. You can't use any kind of noise here uh, that would like uh, you know attract the people in the campfire. And you can also use any kind of dynamites here. So, so Sam and you know, Doc, you don't have to use much. It's all about using uh, Kate O'Hara and uh, what do you call John Cooper. So we are here at this, this point. I can use Kate O'Hara to pretty easily take care of this guy here. Uh, I'll have to crawl, get closer. I'll use my charm. Uh -huh. Okay, just use the charm and he's gonna get attracted. These guys get attracted PZ easily. Bonita mochacha. Okay, so we're uh, almost down here. So I'll, I'll take all my heroes. Make sure enemies are more aware of noises at night and their vision is reduced. So at night, you don't want to run. You just like walk or crawl. Okay, so most of my heroes are over here. I need to uh, stab this guy. Make sure he don't wake up. Okay, I have to cut this rope using my knife. And I have to be really careful here not to get discovered by any of these uh, people at the campfire. Uh, pick up pick up this horse saddle one by one and put them on horses. And uh, watch their uh, field of view very carefully. Put them on another horse. So you need to put them on a total of uh, four horses. Just wait here until this uh, fat guy passes. Then you can uh, get the last saddle. So I can get the last saddle. Okay, so I'm going to get the last saddle. Okay, so put him on another horse. There we go. Now I need to take all my heroes and uh, get them into one horse each. One, ho one horse each for everyone. So everybody can like drag one horse with them together. Okay, so John Cooper got like one horse. Make sure I don't run at all. And get another horse from here. See us. Uh, wait for the lasso thing to appear and 
then the uh, the horse that has no like saddle will automatically follow you. Everybody can get like one horse each. So that's the idea. Pretty awesome. So all the horses are taken out into that secluded valley. Uh, nobody would know where they are. Okay, so now right now John Cooper will do the rest. I have to be really careful here because I have to get rid of... Okay, so I have to rescue this guy. I mean... Cut his, uh, cut the ropes on him, knock him out, and pick him up, and get out of there all at once. Looks like I have successfully done it. And uh, what they're gonna think, hey, where's that prisoner go? And uh, they're gonna get agitated and they're gonna check the horses. See and saw like all the horses are gone, and they're gonna think this prisoner took all the horses. See, and that's that's gonna keep the heat off from them because they're gonna be looking for that uh, Yankee soldier as the prisoner. So now he's gonna let the leader know who's in the house, and he's gonna check himself. See, there there are no horses. He's gonna get pissed. Caramba, diablo! How could you let the soldier get away, you lousy bastardos estúpidos? And where are our horses? Mierda! I'm surrounded by tontos. He is mad. So now he's gonna get on the horses and uh, ride to Sanchez's headquarters. Okay, so now it's our turn to follow them. And that's it. That's how you complete the mission. This is a pretty uh, easy mission if you plan your strategies carefully. I hope this little uh, gameplay tutorial was helpful to you and enjoyable to watch. Be sure to like and subscribe. And thank you so much for watching. You have a good one.